Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 104 in Candy Crush Friends Saga, where we have 26 moves to fill 5 empty hearts. I brought Otis in to help me, uh, because he only needs 8 purple before he gets filled and sends some stripes. Yeti was the one who was recommended, and I really do like wrapped candies. But I think on a fill the hearts board, stripes are going to help very much as well. So let's just see how this goes. And if it doesn't work, I might consider bringing in Yeti. Here are two hearts, here are two hearts, and here is the fifth. Uh, here's where they need to go, but I'm much less interested in that. I want to strike these hearts directly if I can. And if I can make a special as I go, well, that's good too, because then that's struck over to this side. And I want to, of course, hit as many hearts at the same time as I can. Although, unfortunately, sometimes I can't hit anything, so I'll just make a special here. It doesn't help to hit the receptacle, only the actual hearts themselves. I don't see a way to hit this one. It feels like I should be able to, but I just can't see it. I don't see a way to hit this one. I don't see a way to hit these two. As a matter of fact, very few moves on the board. Let's take this and hope for some cascading. No, but it did set this up, or I could make a f uh, fish, but I'm going to do this. And now when I can't hit these directly, and I can't, that's when I'll go ahead and do something else. I've almost got Otis ready to go. Oh, but look at this, I can hit two hearts. And now we're going to see their real power, because they can hit through really thick barriers. Okay, so we got a couple stripes. I just don't see how useful they are right now. But we might end up joining them together later. Okay, I can hit a heart directly. See, I can hit these guys and take them off one by one. Uh, and that's the hard way. If I can hit the heart, the heart goes through all of those layers. So that's what has to be my aim. I can't set those off. Let's go ahead and set off the fish. There we go. And they kind of ran into the stripes, which is bound to happen. And it does set them off. It's just not spectacular when that happens. All right, can I hit these guys directly? I don't see it. Can I make any cascades to hit them? I don't see that either. But I will bring this downward. And I can hit this heart as I do this. Yeah, I can see that the stripes aren't very helpful on this board. I mean, they could be, but they haven't been yet. Hmm. I can make another fish, but instead I'm going to hit a heart directly. I have to be aware of the fact that I've only got a few moves here. Although, gosh, I like this wrapped candy because... Wrapped can hit both things. Now, I could make a fish here, I could make a fish here, but I can hit both of these hearts at the same time. And once I start collecting these hearts, then they're out of my way. So yeah, let's blow things up and get these out of my way. So now I only have three hearts on the board. I've got a more open space. Finally, this stripe is going to participate. It went from afar and it hit that nicely. Now what? Can I hit this heart directly? I don't see it, but I could move this purple over, and that might have a good effect. Can I hit this heart directly? I don't see it. Can I hit this one directly? I don't see it. So let me move this stripe over. Oops, I didn't get to use it. Hmm. I still can't hit this directly, but now I can hit this one directly. So let's do that. And let's see... I can't hit this directly, but I can break through that layer there. Oh, now I got a couple stripes here. I'm going to do this first, actually. And if this still exists, now I hit this one and this one. So the stripes aren't unhelpful, and it really created a lot of opportunity. But I don't know that I'm going to be able to get this done in time. Yikes. I can't hit... Oh, no, I can't. I can hit him directly. Let's see. 
I feel like I've got a lot of colors combining together, but I only have one move, so yeah, I can't get this done. All right, well, that didn't work very well, so now I'm going to bring in Yeti and see if he's more helpful. Otis, you take a nap. That's a very odd-looking Otis. All right, so Yeti's the one who's recommended. Let's see if taking in the recommended friend helps more. Hmm. I can do this, and that would hit this directly. Do I have any other move that would hit two hearts at once? I don't see it, so let's do this. Yeah, no good moves. So sometimes it doesn't matter what friend it is. Sometimes it matters how good a setup you get. And it's always going to matter how well you play. It may not, you may not be able to win even if you play super well just based on the setup. But it, it doesn't hurt to make sure that you evaluate each opportunity before you take a turn. Speaking of opportunities, I feel like I have few. Okay, let's get through here. See, I need to be able to make more moves than just hitting one heart. That one I couldn't hit any heart except it got hit on the back swing. Okay, so this is the kind of move I want to have happen. And yet he did place the wrapped by the stripe, so that was good. Nice. Now that's here if I can hit it. Gosh, I can't hit this heart directly that I can see but I can make a move next to it, which would open up a couple of things. I can't hit this one. This one's buried. I can't hit this one, and I can't hit this one. Yep, I'm going to go over here. Now I can hit this. Now I'm stuck again, huh? Let's try to make some cascading. No. Okay, now I can bring the cyan down, and that's going to explode things and hopefully get me more cyan to fill him up. Nice. Well, that was fun. I can make a stripe here, I can make a stripe here, or I can hit this directly. Guess which one I'm going to take. Direct hit. Direct hit. Now, got nothing. Oh, I could do this, and that would open this area up. I could make a fish. I think I'm going to open... Oh, no, I can't. This is not like a crystal in regular Candy Crush Saga. It doesn't work that way. Yeah, I'll go ahead and make the fish. Oh, and I'm collecting cyan, so there we go. We got a wrap. That's perfect. Thank you, Yeti. Yeti is being helpful on this board. Okay, so I've got all of these hearts right next to each other. Yikes. I could make a stripe this way, which would help because it would get to Yeti. But I'm going to do this. <sighs> now I want that Yeti opportunity back. Oh, here. If I do this, the yellow will get together and get this heart collected. I forgot to look for cascades, and that's, I think, going to be extremely important on this board, since I can't seem to work in any other way to get these. Let's make a fish, although he's not set up well. Yeah, come on, Yeti, help me. Get something right by this stripe. Yes! Okay, I should have gone for Yeti. I mean, I should have allowed him to do his work. I should have gone for the cyan to collect him quickly. Can I make a strike directly? Well, yeah, I can send off a fish, which should hit it. And now I've got a change here. Ah, uh, that's not enough, is it? All right, so two tries, and it didn't work, but I got closer with Yeti. So I'm going to go ahead and try one more time, and I'm going to bring in Yeti. And I think that now that I understand the board better, I'll be able to act better. Although it's still tough. I could do this, or I could do this green. And the green has a stronger opportunity to make a cascade. But I think what I'm going to do is this, and then, if it exists, I'll do this, and it hits both of these. 
I could do this, which is not a bad move either, but I like the opportunity to hit two hearts at once. Better than making the fish that I saw. Now I think I'll make this uh, fish because it hits this. And I can do this, hitting the hearts directly until I cannot hit the hearts directly. Let's see, I can make this fish, I could make a move along here, or I could try to do something over here, but that seems to be stuck. I'm going to go ahead and make the fish, especially because it's cyan. Let's collect these cyan and get Yeti going for us. Oh, look, we got a couple of hearts hit. Yeti, that was just ridiculous, but thankfully I've got something that might work over here. And now, if I take out all cyan, uh, I can try to fill Yeti again, but I don't have much cyan on the board. I'm going to take out orange instead. That's going to concentrate the colors down. And thankfully it hit the hearts, plus it gave me opportunities to make more specials to hit more hearts. I'm going to work over here directly. I know I see this, and I could hit two things, but I've been stuck over here. Now I'm going to do this. There's something to be said for getting this unstuck and something to be said for just finishing this so I've got more space. And I did a little bit of both. Okay, this wrapped candy is not helpful where it is. It's minorly helpful. But if I move it, hopefully it'll hit a heart. There we go. Nice. And then I can send off this fish and hit the heart again. And so hopefully the fish, there we go, it goes to a different heart and it helps out and now I can hit this heart or I can hit this heart. I'm going to hit this one because it has more of an opportunity to make cascades that might hit this but it didn't. I could do this. I don't think I can hit this directly and I don't see ways to, oh no I can't hit this one directly so I'm going to. Here we go. I can make this stripe, but I'm going to do this instead. It hits this directly and opens things up. Oh my, let's see. Can't hit, can hit. There we go. It's just kind of see having all opportunities. I could do this. I'm thinking about doing this one just because the cascade opportunity seemed better to me and it worked well. Okay, this one's almost gone. There we go. Now we still have two really thick things to get through here. I'm going to make this wrapped candy and try to get things going. Okay, this is looking better now. Three moves, but it's the... Uh, hearts that are easier to bring home here. This wrapped candy combo is just too far away to help. It's close, but it's not quite there. So I'm going to hit the heart directly. That's the best approach. There we go. Got it. Barely, barely, and on my third try, but eventually I got it. Sometimes persistence is what you need to be able to beat these boards. Hopefully you got yours done more quickly, but sometimes failures can be more instructive than wins. And so if you didn't try Otis, you might go, oh yeah, maybe I won't try Otis in the future um, it, when Yeti is recommended. But anyway, that's how I beat this level. If it was helpful, I'd ask that you consider liking and subscribing. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below. And as always, thanks for watching.